today I am doing a favorites video. <laughs> This video is an overall mess. Excuse my hair. Excuse my bed for not being made. Just excuse this whole video. And it will be fixed in the next video. <laughs> I'm just going to get into my favorites. And, um, yes. I'm going to start with this liner because it's right beside me. This is the H2O Proof Liquid Eyeliner by Wet n Wild. I love it. It dries semi-matte. It's not matte like the other one that I like. I like that one because it dries matte. But this one doesn't really dry matte. It dries like a semi-matte. Moving on to the Revealed to palette for from coastal scents as you guys know most of the eyeshadows that i use in my videos are coastal scents um i don't really know why well i just like coastal scents that's why you guys might be saying oh that looks like the naked palette i don't have any of the naked palette but i like this palette because it's more of a rosy tone and you can do a lot of looks with this palette you can do day looks you can do night looks colors that you can use on fair people and then you have colors that you can use on tan to dark skin complexions i use this palette and i absolutely love it the purple in here is what i was attracted to most i thought it was deeper a deeper purple this is more of a plum color i thought it was deeper but i still love this color like i have it on my lids today and i just love this color and this palette so that is the reveal to palette by coastal Scents. um the next color that i just you know thought just decided that I like this color by um, Coastal Scent is Oat Milk Tan and I actually have this on my lids today and it is a matte um, beautiful matte tan color I don't know why I haven't used it I love that it is so tanned and oat milky and vanilla -y. it's just a beautiful tan matte color and I just love it the pigmentation is crazy and I love it I, my next favorite is this um, pressed powder by Mac I mean not not by Mac by um, black radiance and it is in the color ebony I did used to use um, this color um, chocolate I used to use chocolate and I used to use um, rich mahogany but I kind of like this color because it's not that um, harsh on my skin tone I have like oops I just moved my camera I like the fact that this is really a really subtle contour yeah and then my next favorite I picked up the um, soft focus um, finishing powder by black radiance and this is new and it's in the color milk chocolate finish and I absolutely love this color now this color might be a little bit lighter than my skin tone as you guys can see but when I put it on my face it it actually doesn't it's not really that l much lighter than my skin it it blends out really really well my next favorites are these three blushes brushes by real tech technique these were like $20 um I absolutely love these brushes this is the buffer brush this is the contour brush and this is the um, precision brush I think or detailer brush but I love this detailer brush because I use now I use this only for my lids and I was having a problem because I couldn't find a brush small enough to put stuff on my lid and I like to be precise when I put um, eyeshadow mainly on my lid or when I'm doing a cut crease which I don't do often or you guys never seen me do a cut crease at all anyways um, but I love this brush for my lid it is absolutely flawless I, I just like it I it's all good things to say about this brush um, Oh, the only thing that I didn't like about these brushes is um, how small they are. I do have big hands, um, but I wish they were a little bit longer. That's kind of a personal preference. Some people don't mind how small the brushes are, but I mean, I would like longer brushes. But anyways, yeah, um, the next thing. Oh, another reason why I was late jumping on this bandwagon is because I didn't want these brushes because they weren't black or silver. They're orange. I don't really like using brushes that aren't black or silver. I don't know. I'm weird. Um, this buff buffer brush is 
absolutely flawless um, was um, blending out your foundation I kind of wish it was a little bigger but it really doesn't matter because this brush blends stuff out flawlessly um, and then the next brush is this contour brush which is small and rounded I like this brush because it is rounded but then you can also blend out your contour as well and those are my three favorite brushes from that um, pack they did come with a pointed foundation brush but I do not use pointed foundation brushes I don't know why I just feel like they're a waste um, a waste for me because it just sits here I don't use a pointed foundation brush next 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 is this true match foundation I will probably have to get another foundation for the summertime okay on to my next favorite is these lashes that I picked up at Walmart and I don't remember how much these were I know I just saw three sitting there and I was like oh my gosh these look like the Demi Wispies and I just jumped at them and bought them they're not as thick as the Ardell Wispy so I stacked these lashes myself I always stack my lashes because I just I just do um like I don't really yeah I just stack my lashes because I stack my lashes yeah that's a little bit OD but I stack my lashes now I am moving on to my favorite brushes ever to use because I like blending blending is me like you just need to blend like blend blending is the key when it comes to your eyeshadow so I use this Sonia Kashuk brush I use this brush mainly for um uh, my transition color and I uh, use it to blend my other eyeshadows out so this is the Sonia Kashuk um, 109 blending brush and this is very fluffy and I love how it just blends out everything it just flawless flawless it's not too dense it's not too fl fluffy it's just it's just everything go pick up this brush I think it was like $3.99 $4.99 no I think it was three ninety nine yeah um and then I have this coastal sense brush and I think this is one of their best sellers because I know I um got a lot of their best seller brushes um but yeah this is the BRC N06 brush and this is a blending brush but this is more precise and more dense than this brush so I use this to put on my second color eyeshadow and um yeah this is mainly goes in my crease so I like this brush for that am I done I think I'm done <laughs> um yeah I think I'm done um with my yeah talking um, I will see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah. Bye. I love